hidden gems on the 2019 Glastonbury lineup. The must-see musical experience of the weekend is this brand new stage from the BLOCK9 crew, whose club spaces routinely provide the festival's best after-hours moments. IICON, one of the year's breakout stars this domino-signed pop producer was due to put out her second album earlier this year, but the runaway success of its singles You the Brilliant, Larry Heard Indebted Started Out and The Robin Worthy About Work The Dance Floor have both climbed to Radio 1's A-list You has delayed its release to give her time to build. Shell have bangers, if you're feeling a bit special by Sunday morning, it's raining and you just want to drive to the nearest harvester, this lot will get you back in the game. Even the most god, having embraced jazz, dance music, and rap years ago, Glastonbury has been slow to bring metal fully on board but this year has a sprinkling of seriously brilliant names. Venom Prison and spearheading the Roots reggae revival is this teenage Jamaican singer, who flips between plaintive vocals and nimble rapping with enviable ease, and who can absolutely translate her talent to the stage. On a similar reggae tip is Holly Cook whose third album, 2018's Vessel of Love, was criminally underrated. Singing about Rome, Perth songwriter Donnelly has cited Billy Bragg's very suburban, relatable way of talking about real life as a formative influence on her own brilliantly detailed, strikingly low-key songwriter. This weekend she had Barry White lived long enough, he would have made the perfect Sunday legend slot. But this year has the, the Clash stage will bring together different crews in chaotic, combative sound clashes, and this pairing will induce absolute pandemonium dance hall from the heatwave meets grime from butters, resulting in more friction than a pair of chafing wellies. The gem of Glastonbury's sweetest, most indie stage, Nilfer Yinya sound falls somewhere between Sada's bruised heartbreak, the XX's intimacy, and you improbably yet brilliantly you the libertine's most chaotic and galvanizing moments. Her lift shows mixed with a voice that could carry across the whole of Worthy Farm, and excellent Dan Auerbach produced songs to do it justice, Yola You from just down the road in Bristol You should by rights be massive. See her at close, in addition to individual sets, a number of London's boldest jazz collectives will face off in H2H smackdowns over the weekend. The wormhole has the comet is coming v steam down 0000, Friday, Ezra Collective vs Sons of Kemet 000, Saturday, and Kokoroko v Joe Armand Jones 000, Sunday. While London's Jazz Space Total Refreshment Center takes over the Stone Bridge Bar 16.00 U Midnight, Friday with the Steam Down Sound System, Emma Jean Thackeray, Emma Warren, and more. Another local act, but from the other end of the musical spectrum, this Bristol duo recently and improbably played the Albert Hall supporting the horrors. They're tough, album done. The pick of the sets at the new project from Arcadia, Bay of the Fire Breathing Spider of previous years, the Northern Irish duo are already legends to a young generation of ravers, and combined with plumes of flame, they are set to deliver one of the most euphoric moments of the weekend. They also play, by now, everyone knows Peggy Go's understated house shimmy it makes you forget it go in it, probably the only song to unite the usually disparate patrons of BBC Six Music, Radio One and Mixmuck last year. Whether or not she buzzered by name and buzzed by nature, this denim-loving quartet play good times rock and roll, and just wrote a brilliant swaggering anthem for the Homeless World Cup. If you're not for women who have helped define a joyous, breakbeat-friendly corner of the house and techno underground come together to fire the starting pistol on a weekend of dancing. Paris-born Pierre Hatch was trying to make it as a dancer in the mid-2000s but rejected for his size. He decided to throw expect tears before bedtime at this late night celebration of the prodigy's late green haired mischief maker. We don't know what Zambian born, Botswana raised, Australia dwelling rapper Sampa the Great emerged in 2015 and has been building ever since, supporting artists including Kendrick Lamar. It's a journey that her one for the early ravers Canada's Jada G is an environmental toxicologist by day, disco house maven by night and responsible for one of the year's best albums and significant changes. Her banging live set MSN are empowering women in sport this summer. Find out more about Gallery Glastonbury's most iconic headliners bang showbiz. <laughs> Smoking no cooking the hot bar. Fucking on your bitch, yeah.
Looking up, open the pork pot.